Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Dion, a photographer here in New York City. I urge you guys to come follow me on social media, it's linked below, IG and Twitter. Check out my work, see what I do. Also subscribe to the channel, I will really appreciate it. Today, we are checking out a photo shoot from The Boys. Now this was requested by one of my subscribers 4,000 times, so I'm finally doing it. I'm finally doing it. You know who you are. Um, now it seems to be, f wait, for the members? Let me see. Yes, for the members for Singles Korea May 2022. Uh, now, originally, I was going to have all week long concept photo shoots, but today is obviously the exception. We're doing a magazine shoot again. Um, but don't worry. Don't worry. Please leave some concept photos you want me to check out in the comment section below, and I'll check those out, and I will have more of those next week, so don't worry. Um, now, it says the members are new. Okay. Kevin. Young Jay. And Young Hoon, Hyunjae, Hyunjae, is that how you pronounce it? Who is who though? Let me see. Okay, new has the black hair, right? Okay, they, okay, I'm like new has the black hair because on on this website, they're showing for the members and like okay wait, but I don't think the photos that they're like yeah they're not matching up, so I can't tell who's who. All right, I guess we'll just learn. You guys let me know below who is who and what is what and how and how. Because I don't I don't know. All right, y'all. The first image is the cover. Okay. So, already I'm loving the color palette. I don't know if I'm living for the orange uh, font. I don't know if I'm living for that. But, but I'm living for the outfit choices. We're getting a black and white color scheme with the outfits. We got some leather, I think. We got some oversized jackets. We got some tanks. We got some deep V-neck. Ooh, I like this V-neck, the one with the blonde, the blonde hair. He better work with that V-cut. Mmm, I like that. Now I don't recognize no one. That's a bummer. Cause like I I I love the boys' music. They've been really giving me life, especially the last few comebacks. I've been living my best life because of the boys. Um, Steeler is still my jam. Like, I can't express enough about Steeler. And what's the other song that I really like? Th Thrill Ride. Thrill Ride, Steeler. Ooh. Low key, Maverick, too. I don't live for Maverick like I live for the other two, but I'm kind of, I'm kind of into it. It, it grew on me. At first I was like, mm, okay. Then it, then it grew on me. Now I'm like, all right, Maverick, I, you made some points. And then they have another song that came out recently. Was it for a movie or a video game or a drama? I think that was the boys, right? Oh, I hope it's the boys. I hope it's not no one else. I, th I think it's the boys. I think it's the boys. They did a song for something. I don't know, but I don't know these four members. In particular. I don't. I don't know anyone's name, but there's. I think to be two members I can recognize by just seeing them, and none of them are here, unfortunately. All right, next image. So we got the four together again. This is a standard posing. Two at the top, two at the bottom. They're sitting. They're standing. I like it. The blonde one is giving me life. I love, and I mean love, how his hair is styled. That little swoop and like wispy situation. I'm into it. I'm into it. I'm into this leather vest thing he had going on. This stylist went off in this shoot, y'all. Come on out. Look, I mean, the homeboy in the back. The homeboy in the back with this jacket that's kind of bulky. You can see his like uh, collarbone. It's kind of like big on him, but it's also tight. It's tight on the arm, but the rest of the like the the wrist part is tight. But then the rest of it is like bulky and big. That's so interesting to me. I like that. The other two are kind of more. They're not as edgy as the other two. Well, he has a leather jacket because these two on the side have the leather jacket. And homeboy over here has a leather jacket, but this t-shirt is not giving me cool guy vibes. I think. And this one with the white or cream color jacket is giving me Miami Vice, which I love me some Miami. I'm from Florida, but I don't know if it fits the the vibe. But they did tie it in with the black shirt, so it's not like it's 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 still cohesive. It's still cohesive. It's just a little too different from the other three. So I'm kind of like, oh, you stand out a little bit. But maybe that's the point. Maybe that's the point. Next image. Ooh, I like this. 
moody black and white homeboy over here on the staircase those lips and that cupid's bow do y'all see it who is this i'm living i'm living what's he wearing something has a tank top or jersey type of tank top on with the jacket on oh, these pants you can tell oh there's no belt but you can tell they're tight on the on the body shirt's tucked in they might Cause I'm looking at the, I'm looking at the, I don't know, detailing barbs. I'm not sure what these little metal thingies on the pants. They kind of match the jackets, little holes, kind of, sorta. Oh, homeboy, here's a Valentino necklace. Ooh, with this, this jacket looks like it's, what's that material? It's not trash bag material. It's not plastic, but it looks kind of plastic. It definitely doesn't look leather. It looks like more plastic type material with this jacket. I like it. And he is vascular. Look at his hands, y'all. That blood is pumping. That blood is pumping. Pump it louder. Okay. I like this image. I like this image. I like the composition. Now, I wish Homeboy's head wasn't cut off, obviously. But, you know, other than that, I'm really into this. Next image, we have the other two. We're giving full body. Okay. Homeboy the blonde. He's eating everyone up every time I see him. I'm loving the body language. I'm loving the outfit. These pants being baggy over his shoes. These black and white shoes that go with the black and white top. The black pants. The blonde hair quaffed. I love his whole look. I sure do. I sure do. I love this. I love this. And homeboy in the back. Um, I probably would have lived for his outfit because I love... I love a sleeveless vest situation he has going on here. And having the jacket off, it's a color palette. It's just these pants. If the pants were black, I probably would like give my life to this. Honestly, honestly, the pants are interesting. I, I probably wouldn't wear it, but they are cool looking. But if they were black, it just would have went with the vibe a bit more. I'm not sure why they picked this color. Actually, I don't live for the pants. I don't know if being black pants will save it. I'm getting closer to it. It looks like ratty undergarments. I don't... Mm, okay. Well, from the waist up, I'm living. From the waist down, choices were made. Choices were made. Next image. Ooh. He looks so haunting. I love this... Um. This type of tank top. I've been seeing tank tops like this recently. Actually, this is one guy I knew, the stylist. He started his own clothing brand. He also has tank tops with the, the sides. The the you know how you have a strap here. Sometimes the strap will go over here instead, and he'll have like there'll be hole like a hole here, hole in the back. Your back's out. I've been seeing different brands do this kind of type of tank top. I kind of like it. I'm kind of into it. It's different. It's unique, but it's not too crazy. But it's crazy enough to be kind of like futuristic almost kind of i'm into it so we got we got we got the shoulder of the jacket off um i do wish this jacket was a bit darker it's giving me a gray vibe i wish it was black i don't know maybe i'm just thinking of black and white i mean the color scheme still works and maybe it is black it just looks kind of brighter because the lights are probably on it um but i wish the jacket was a bit darker however i love his expression um i like the tank top it's a fine image. It's a fine image. Next shot. Oh, we got a full body of that look. Wait a minute. Now, I think I like this picture more. Yeah. This picture is giving me a bit more than the other one was giving. I'm loving all this. <laughs> all this. Now, these shoes, they're a choice, however. The choices work. Also, having... Obviously, these pants are not the same color white as the shirt, but it's close enough. And having the black at the top and the black at the bottom tied in. Maybe that one image with the guy with those big old parachute pants he had on. Maybe he had a big old bold black shoe. I'd feel differently about it. But we couldn't even see this shoe, so maybe I don't know. However, this kind of works. Like We don't need black and white, black and white, kind of like that. But if we can have it here, there, there, and here to kind of keep it together like this, it all works, in my opinion. What do you guys think? Next image. Oh, okay, wasn't he wearing this shirt in the other one? Ooh, another I'm using the same shirt, y'all, for another look. Ooh. Um, well, we departed from the black and white. We went straight to red. 
two different red. We got a red. We got a burgundy. We got gold. Um, now, I don't see it as cohesive with the whole shoot as the other images were. Um, but it's fine. I don't mind the styling. Well, kind of. This shirt, I don't dislike it. I don't. I This would have worked better if he, they would have kept it real simple. Because it's sleeveless. And the other image, he had the jacket on. No, yeah. He, they should have just had the shirt with some black pants and called it a day. And maybe, maybe like a bold earring. And called it a day. I like this jacket. I like these pants. I like this shirt. I don't like them together. That's what it is. That is what it is. I don't like them together. It's giving me... I don't, it's not giving me nothing. It's giving me a mess. But I like the individual pieces. Just not together on him. Next image. Um, Is this Gucci? This sweatshirt? I like this. I mean, it's not a traditional standard portrait. And that's why I kind of like it. It's depth of field. He's focused... Where is he in focus that? Is it on his eye? It seems like his hair is the one that's in focus and everything else is blurry. It melts down to being blurry, which is interesting. Typically, pictures like this, most times an eye will be in focus and everything else is blurry. But this picture, it's the hair. And that does happen. Sometimes your camera will focus on certain parts of what's in front of them, the first the first things in front of them. and, and Or it might be intentionally done. They could have manually focus it like this. Like, okay, I'm going to focus on the hair. It's going to melt away out of focus that, that could be the photographer or the creative director's uh vision oh, someone messaged me their vision um but i like this i like this picture i like that i like i've seen this um, sweatshirt before i believe it's um i believe is i believe it's gucci if i'm not mistaken if i'm not mistaken i believe it's gucci and i'm here for it i'm here for it all right next image we got our blonde boy again this this is the look they went off on him. First of all, with the hair. The hair is already giving me what I need. But then how he's wearing his outfit, these white pants and this jacket or um, sleeveless vest. Um, I'm into it. Wait, sleeveless vest? Aren't vests already sleeveless? I guess there's some vests that are kind of like with a sleeve. I don't know. Anyways, the vest. I'm into it. I'm into it. He... He said, you're going to get his arm. I've been working out. Working on my fitness. I like this. The black backdrop seems like it might be blown out a little bit. Maybe. I don't know. But overall, probably one of my favorite images of the whole shoot, if not the favorite, possibly. We're going to see. But I'm into this. Go ahead. Next image, we have Homeboy again. Oh, I like this. It has a documentary feel to it. Now, what is he wearing? It seems like... Okay, I was like, I know he ain't pulling his underwear out, but he might be having two pairs of pants, or the pants have like a, a look, another layer to them. Huh. Now, this shirt I'm into. He, okay, keep him in sleeveless stuff, because he he rocking it. He's giving me rock star vibes with his sleeveless stuff he's been wearing this whole shoot. Yep. Yep. He's giving me what I need right now in this photo shoot. I'm not sure what his name is. You guys let me know who this is, but he's been serving since the beginning, since the cover shot, since we started. We have to give him his flowers. And I think I remember him from the music video. Um, what's, what's the uh, Giddy Up? Giddy, giddy up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait, is that the boys? Hold on, let me see. I don't be wrong. And Giddy Up is not the boys. Let me check real quick because I'm going to be so embarrassed. But I feel like I've seen, because I remember the scene of someone on the, on the like, you know, the pinball machine. They're on top of them. They're sitting down. I could think that's him because he's blonde here. And I'm not sure if he was giddy up the boys. Yep. Okay. I was right. <laughs> giddy, giddy. That's my jam. That's the first song I heard from them. And I was like, excuse me. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You, you, the boy, the boys. Now, wait, actually I'm lying. I think the song boys or something like that is it called boys what's that first song he did is it called boys i always think this is the their debut song for some reason but i think oh it's called boy okay their debut songs boy four years ago goodness um even though i i did see this video obviously before i saw giddy up i just giddy up the one who just grabbed me and i'm like oh that's their debut <laughs> Was Boy the pre-release single? Maybe that's what it is. Or am I, I could be wrong. You guys let me know below. But 
That's why I think. Maybe that's why I'm getting everything wrong. Next image. Okay, so this one with the lips. Who's it? Who's this again? Who was he in the other shot? I'm looking for this though. That lip shape, that nose, his nose. Whoa, it's. Mm hmm. I'm living for the bang. I'm living for the haunting vibe of him. I'm living for all this. Simple portrait, sinister. It's giving me anime. Um, not villain, but like. Oh, actually, yes. No. Protect. No, good guy. Have you seen? Have you seen? Um, Death Note. It's giving me L. It's giving me L. I think because the eyeliner, how he looks sleepy and like you know sunken in. I think that's why. All right, y'all. Time for the final image. It's him again, full body. Okay, he wearing a little Prada shirt. Come on, Prada. I know you proud of me. Come on, Prada. Um, I like this. I probably like this more than I like the the, the close up shot. Surprisingly enough, because I love a portrait. I love a portrait. However, I'm living for this. I'm living for this. I'm, I like. I love the styling. I like the posing. He still give me the same kind of face as the first one, so it all works together. I like it. He he better go off. Whoever this is, he better go off. All right, guys, we are at the end. We are at the end. So now we get to pick out our favorite image. Which one is it going to be? I'm going to go. Um, okay, I'm going to go with Homeboy, the blonde one with, with, with um, the black jumpsuit. It's not a jumpsuit. This, you, you see it on the screen. That's, that's the image. Yes, homeboy's pants in the back are unfortunate, but I love this image overall. They're both giving the face, the body, the posing. It's giving. The pants are unfortunate. They are unfortunate, but we're going to let it rock. We're going to let it We're gonna let it rock, okay? Now, let me know your favorite below. Let me know your favorite below. Which is your favorite image? Who is your bias if they're in here? If your bias is not in here, who is your favorite among these four? Is this an actual factual subunit? I don't know. Uh, let me know below. Also, suggest some other shoots from the boys. Um, it could be editorials or concept photos you guys can pick. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video.